Please review the video on getting started with EdMaps Pro to learn how to select county data within My EdMaps or create custom data sets so they are available on your EdMaps Pro app. Furthermore, once you have managed your My County list and custom data sets on the website, you will be able to turn them on and off on your EdMaps Pro app as needed. Within the EdMaps Pro app, tap the three horizontal dashes in the upper left side of the screen to bring down the menu. From here, tap either county data sets or custom data sets. The process is the same for both. Tap the download icon if you would like to add them to your device. or the trash icon if you would like to remove them. You can refresh the data set by tapping the refresh icon. And you can decide whether or not you want to show the data set on your invasives map or hide them by swiping green to show or gray to hide and you can show more than one data set at a time. Once the data sets you are interested in are downloaded and visible on your Invasives map, you then have the option to filter data. To do this, go to the Invasives map and tap the map setting icon at the top right. You can see the filter options in the second half of the screen. And you can filter data by status. So positive, treated, eradicated, or negative. You can filter by state lists, species, observation date, last visit date, or by unverified. You will only see unverified or unreviewed records if you are an EdMaps verifier or if the records are yours. If you ever want to remove a filter, just tap clear all filters at the bottom. And if your state is not included in the state list, please contact, please contact us to add it. To get out of the map settings, tap the icon again.